And let's signify all those items I just found in the dungeon. Let's start with the trial. Ouch. Sculpture charm. Increases accuracy and can render an enemy immobile. That's pretty good. Two-handed weapon, so I can't use my shield. Um, big attack boost drops my defense, evade, evade, and defense by two. Not yet. Yep. Metal shield. Okay. Well, that even a thief can equip it means also a ninja can equip it. Let's see if I'm going to do this. I'll the battle axe. I'm not going to sell this monster to the actually a narrative, potentially narrative important item. I'll definitely give that to Kyo. Kyo can use, I uh, can learn spells. Okay. Okay, that's cool. I did not know that. Alright, so we have our offense as well, Captain. about entirely. Alright, so, so I think I'm gonna do Durgan, I put the axe. Hand over the axe to Ricardo. Put the shield to Ricardo. Let me clip it. This is pay by one. And hand this over.
slime is actually hung onto that instead of using it, and I could have combined it with a couple other slime items and did a healing spell. Then leveled up, use it to level up the healing spell. Nope, don't want to do that. Labyrinth. I have a better idea of what I'm... It's okay, so now... Leveled up the mage. Oh, leveled up the, the ninja. Boosted the spellcasting ability. different. single attack weapon. Okay. The balance DPS versus not DPS.
Jack Rank Cobalt. Sir, I might be able to level up again soon. One little stone, and this one's for Daddy Orc. Two little stone, and this one's for Mommy Orc. An orc was singing enthusiastically while playing with various stones. Dolly Orc. Huh? Don't you wanna... Plays with the stones also? No. Okay, okay. He was a nice guy. Let's make it a stone labyrinth. Don't you think we need to see the labyrinth in the labyrinth? Yo, dog. I heard you like labyrinths. I'll put labyrinths in your labyrinth so you can crawl while you crawl. Oh, by the way, his eyes guts. Don't forget it's my name. Oh, I know. I give you this as a token of friendship. Gods of Ground for a stone to give, and that one was nicely shaped and of decent size. You've got a labyrinth stone. Take good care of it, okay? I'll be playing here with my stone, so it comes by when you feel it come by when you feel like it. Couple of those I can use those to buy those to create healing items. Okay. First time in the labyrinth, let me tell you. Take a look here. Ricardo pointed the wall ahead. See the cracked wall ahead? 
a strange kind of wall. No matter how many times it gets wrecked, it mends itself. Nobody knows why this happens. One of the many odd things that occurs in the labyrinth. This kind of wall exists everywhere in the labyrinth. Don't worry, it's easy to break. All you have to do is run through. Now let's go. There's none running! Press the O button and directional button to run. In running, please note the stamina gauge at the upper right. Your stamina will decrease as you keep running. Please be aware that you will not be able to run when your stamina runs out. Alright, let me kill you first, because I can't run through the wall to run away. Sarah's leveled up. Kyo is literally one experience point from leveling up. One measly experience point. A yeah, pretty good running start. Bunch of harpies this time, so it looks like this time we are actually going to find out what the picture of building are. And the answer is a fair amount of damage claw attack. Oh, she can attack the back ranks. Okay. Um, alright. transfer potion this time. So, Kyo, can you, um, sorcerer spells too? Okay.
just a regular short sword. Actually, no, I will sell the dagger. Um, look, um, I'll sell the dagger. If I use a uh, second weapon as an offhand weapon, I think I'll use the short sword. Um, get paid a lot of cash for you sell appraised items, so there's that. Which definitely makes it worth your definitely makes it worth your while. All right, so I think I will call it a session for today. We've gotten gotten to our possibly our third area, or second or third area. Um, as far as for next time, we shall see. Um, um, it as far as for doing Super Robot Wars, that's still on the docket. It's I think will be delayed more of a delay to do that because I have to ship. But I'm ordering a physical gift card from uh, Singapore to get the rest of the DLC. And so a bit more of a hold up on ordering that so I can make sure I get that and the little shipping and that sort of thing. So what I'll do is I'm probably going to be, is as a placeholder game, I'm probably either going to do more wizardry or I'm going to do some... Uh, beautiful Joe. Since now that I now I've got PS2 working with Elgato, and I can do that just fine. But that'll be next time. Um, more PS2 games. So until next time, thank you very much for watching. Catch you later. Heck yeah. But rewind for a second. Probably definitely going to be doing um, some more wizardry because wizardry is kind of set up in a way where it makes for a good placeholder stopover game for a beautiful... We'll see how it goes. It'll either be Beautiful Joe or it'll be Wizardry. I'll figure out figure that out over the course of the week. Um, take a look at the quick fact for Beautiful Joe, so many levels we're talking about, because I want to average about one level per, uh, per episode for that, if I'm doing Beautiful Joe. So, catch you next time. Thank you very much for watching.